Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MDK Global. I'm here in Nottingham. With me, I've got Dalton Smith. Dalton, what a class performance you put on there against a very tough opponent. Today. How do you feel, feel you did on your debut? Um, you know, obviously, I'm quite, I mean, I'm quite harsh on myself. You know, I got the win, did what I had to do, but I just think I was rushing it a little bit early on. You know, I could have relaxed a little bit more, but I think that's been live on TV, you know, on Sky for my debut. Maybe there were quite a little bit of nerves there, but you know, I got the win. That's what I had to do. But I wish I just relaxed a little bit more early on. Do you think you hit on some clutch shots? That, uh, I thought he actually touched down with his gloves sometimes because he sort of knees went. Did you feel like you, you could have got the stoppage? Yeah, I think if I, if I put it on him a little bit more and put uh, a lot more fluids together, I'd have probably got him out of there. But I didn't want to rush things. I just wanted to relax and to make sure I put a, a clean performance in. But yeah, he was a very tough guy and some big shots and fair play to him. He stayed in there. He stayed in there. That's yeah. the thing. Yeah, I spoke to you in Liverpool on the. Uh, uh, Fadler, Fitz, uh, Fitzgerald yeah. show uh, card. You were buzzing for your debut. I spoke to you at the press conference. You were yeah. buzzing for your debut. Yeah. How was it? Was it everything oh, you ever imagined? Everything I dreamt. You know, being live on Sky in front of a big crowd. And I got a decent reception from the fans who come down as well. So, you know, it's a dream come true. You dream of doing this from being a boy. You know, watching the boxing on the weekends. You think I want to be there one day, but it's finally here. And you know it's everything I've, I dreamt of. What's next for you then? When you next out, you're, you're, you're obviously want to stay busy. It's your debut, yep. so where can we see you? Yeah, I want to be out in the next couple of weeks if I can. You know, with Frank and Eddie, I think they'll keep be keeping me active. And you know, as long as I'm fighting regular, I'm going to keep improving. You said you wanted to be a chef. This is great. Yes. Yep. This is one step towards that. One step towards it, yeah. <laughs> but again, you're a light well for your That's the, the division you're competing in. Is that? Is that yeah. yeah. Light well, yeah. yeah that's like, the one. Very, very good division. Yeah, it's a very tough division. You know. That's good, that's exciting fights are going to be in the future, you know, and there's plenty of fights to be made, obviously, when I've established my, my name in the weight, so, you know, it's a very exciting weight to be in, I'm looking forward to it. Is there more pressure on you having your, your, your dad as your coach when you go back to the corner? Does he, is, it, is it a father-son relationship, or does he just, yeah. your dad just switch off and go straight to coach mode? He's just a coach mode, you know. Yeah. He, I know the advice he gives to me, it's only for my best, so I listen. Um, but yeah, my dad's coached me since I was five, so it's nothing new to me. You know, we're relaxed in the corner, and you know, I know the tactics it gives me, it'll work. You didn't get your opponent out of there, yeah. but uh, again, he's durable. But do you think, with your sort of style, the way you are, with like, your hands down when you're enjoying yourself and stuff like that, the slick, the slick of the shots and catching him, do you think with somebody that's coming with a bit more ambition, he's yeah. going to come and maybe swing shots at you, the more shots you can slip, the more yeah. shots you can counter? Do you feel like that's when you're going to get the stoppage more? Yeah, I think someone who comes to fight, you know. You know, that's when there's more openings there to be made. You know, when I get someone who comes and fights, you know, that's when I know I look my best. You know, I've looked my best to get in the World Series of Boxing. You know, get some of the best amateurs in the world. So, you know, when I've got a good competitor in front of me, that's when uh, you'll see me perform. But, you know, this is early on in my career and it's all part of developing. So, well, you, you brought a good crowd down here. Forget me, I don't know how far she from this. Yeah. I don't think it's that far. It's 45 minutes, so it's close to be on a match room show. So I'm looking yeah, There you go. But when, can we, when are you headlining on a show on Sheffield? Oh, who knows? It's too early to say. It's too early to say, but who knows next year if there's any uh, names out there in Sheffield, you know, and these titles there. You know, maybe we could get on the next gen show, but that's that's ahead in the future. All, all it's about now is just developing and learning, and you know, listening to the advice from Eddie and Frank. You want to know? It's me. How many fights you want for the for the end of this year? I want to. I'd like to get five or six in, even though that'd be very active. But you know, if I can be out five or six times for the end of the year, I'll be happy. I've got to ask you because obviously you are a super lightweight, lightweight. Yeah. Josh Taylor is yeah. in World Boxing yeah. Super Series. It's your division. Yeah. Um, Josh is fighting a tough opponent, Ivan Branch. Yeah. What your opinion on, on that fight itself? Josh Alder. You know, I, I love his style. I love Josh as a fighter. You know, I, I watch him and learn from him myself, and you know, I think that's just going to be a Taylor win all day, and I can't wait for it. I'm, I'm hoping to be up there for that fight. Well, you'll see so, there, definitely. Yeah, all the best to him. Is he one of the fighters that you wish to maybe share with him one day? Yeah, that's it. If he's the if he's the number one, when it's my time to come around, you know, that's who I have to fight. Then, you know, I'd, I'd be I'd be happy to. But you know, it's Josh's time now to win that world title and bring it back to Great Britain. Good stuff. Well yeah. done and again. I've seen you got a delivery order there. Yeah, what, yeah, what, so what was it? Five guys. What was it? Wagamama. Wagamama. Good choice. Good choice. Into that. Yeah. Enjoy it. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.